boys and girls, I am happy that you're able to show up today to praise God. And um, my story is loving one another. Loving one another. And there was a story that happened in Hawaii about um, a military family that moved to, um, to Hawaii and they, ha the, um, they decided to live on military base. So the house that they got had a big avocado tree, huge one. And then um, it was harvest time, so it's a lot of avocado. And um, the rules was we have to, um, the family have to clean, you know, under the tree, making sure, you know, in the military family, you have to make sure your yard is clean and everything. So this avocado is harvesting, it has a lot of them. Couples, I mean, they can't eat all of them. So they decided to share with the neighbors, you know, you come in and you get it, but you don't have to come in and get it and go sell it to make money off of it. So we were sharing with um, everybody that comes in. And there was this family that came in, they were from Hawaii, I mean, they were Hawaiian people. and. Um, they brought a lot, um, like big bags, barrels, and all kinds of stuff. That means they were going to sell it. And they came like a few times in the week, during that week. And um, those living in the house got out and said, hey, um, you can get it, but you don't have to go sell it. We're just sharing, you know? You make a mess and you leave, but then the next day you come, at, you come again, with a barrel and then you're going to sell it. And one of them, they were huge. One of them says, go back to your country. You don't, you don't get to um, tell us what to do here. And um, for, for a second, I knew that that was Satan. It wasn't, you know, Satan has been working so hard to tear us all apart, to let, let you know where you come from, who are you to talk to me, what everything that they can do just to make you feel uncomfortable. And um, the Bible says, for God so loved the world. If you just check that phrase, that first line, he loved the whole world. He didn't love you by yourself. He didn't love just me. He loved. And if we think about it, we have all kinds of flowers in this world, and they all make it so pretty to look at. So God loved us, and he still loves us. And we have to find a way to love one another and not make each other feel uncomfortable. Because I know what they said wasn't nice, but they said it anyway. And at that time, we had just got here in, um, from, from Ghana, and in my head, I was like, hey, dude, I just got here. You can't just kick me out, you know, <laughs> in my head. <laughs> so um, let's try and love one another. Um, there is this phrase that I'd like to share with all of you. Just a second. It was um, Russ Tuff, and um, he said, you're my brother, you're my sister, so take me by the hand. Together we will work until he comes. There is no foe that can defeat us when we walk in side by side. As long as there is love, we will stand. What do you say? Amen. So let's keep loving one another. <laughs> 